Today we are going to learn arithmetic sequence and series. So before we starting this exercise, first of all we have to learn formula and the formula of T n last term. Last term T n formula is a plus n minus d, where a is known as first term and d is common difference. A is known as first term, d is common difference, and n is known as number of term. After that, S n formula sum of n term. We have a two formula n by two a plus l. N means number of term, a means first term, l means last term. Similarly, we have another formula of S n n by two bracket two a plus n minus one d. Here, S n means sum of n term, n means number of term, a means first term, n means number of term, and d means common difference. To find out common difference, we have a formula: d is equal to t two minus t one or t three minus t two or t n plus one minus t n. Also, we can write down the difference formula is this. In arithmetic sequence or series, the difference will be equal. Next one is arithmetic mean. So, to find out arithmetic mean, suppose we have an example: if a, b, c R in arithmetic progression, then what is the value of B? B is known as arithmetic mean. It is at the middle of A and C, so B is known as arithmetic mean of A and C. So B is equal to we can write A plus C by two. Suppose we can take next example also. If A B C D E, if there are five terms, then B C D is known as arithmetic mean, and the first term is A, and the last term is B, and B C D is known as arithmetic mean. And here we have to find out difference. So here we have a different formula. D is equal to formula is B minus A by n plus one. B is known as last term. Here l is also known as last term. B is also known as last term. B means what is here? E. A is known as first term. In the place of A, here is A only. N means number of mean. So here number of mean is B C D. So how many means are here? Three. So n is equal to three. N means number of mean which lies between first and last. First means A, last means E, and the number of mean is B, C, D, three. So we have to write here three plus one. Hope you understand this uh, formula related with arithmetic sequence series. And now let's take a start exercise nine point three. Here you can see the question if. X plus two, three x, and four x plus one are in AP. These three terms given, which is in AP arithmetic progression, find x. We have to find out the value of x. Let's take a start solution. Here, x plus two, three x, and four x plus one are. In AP arithmetic progression, it means what the difference between second and first term, third and second term are equal. It means T two minus T one is equal to T three minus T two. When the sequence or series are in arithmetic progression, the difference are equal. So we can write here three x minus x plus two is equal to four x plus one. Minus 3x. The difference are equal. T2 minus T1, T3 minus T2 are equal. Now let's open the bracket. 3x minus x minus plus minus 2 is equal to 4x plus 1 minus 3x. So 3x minus x we can write here 2x minus 2, which is equal to we have these two are like terms, so we can subtract 4x minus 3x x. Plus one. Now we have to arrange and we have to solve. So two x minus x is equal to one plus two. Therefore, what is the value of x here? Three. So we have to find out the find x. So we get value of x. Why to subtract here? If quotient in the form of arithmetic progression, then the difference are equal. Difference means t two minus t one, t three minus t two. Okay. So hope you understand this question. Now look at next. Here, question number one: B find the ten term. We have to find out t ten, ten term of two, six, ten, fourteen, dash dash. Solution. 
here given sequence is given sequence is what is here 2 6 10 14 da, da, da. how to know this sequence is arithmetic or geometric or harmonic so if we are talking about arithmetic only arithmetic means difference are equal you can see look at here 6 minus 2 when you subtract this to what we get here 4 10 minus 6 we get 4 14 minus 10 we get 4 it means difference are equal so this is what arithmetic sequence or series we can say now here what is the value of a a means first term a means here 2 d common difference common difference what i told you you have to subtract from second term second term and first term we have to subtract 6 minus 2 is equal to 4 you can write 10 minus 6 also or you can write 14 minus 10 also d will be get 4 only here we get d is equal to 4 now what we have to find out 10 term so we know that what is the formula of tn we know that tn what is the formula of tn a plus n minus 1 d and we have to find out 10 term it means n is equal to what 10 so in the place of n we have to write on 10 and a plus in the place of n we have to write on 10 10 minus 1 d so we can get a plus 9 d 10 minus 1 9 d what is the value of a we got here 2 so here 2 we have to write 9 into value of d is equal to 4 so 4 we have to write now we have to calculate this 2 plus 4 nines are 36 and when you add we get here 38 so what is the value of t 10 38 so 10 term of this sequence is 38 now look at next question number 1c find the 120 term we have to find out 120 term t 120 we have to find out of the progression one sequence is given here here given sequence is 56 53 50 47 that's yes, yes. a is equal to what is here first you can write here first term or directly a also you can write a means first term which is 56 now we have to find out common difference d d is equal to what i told you you have to second term minus first term or third term minus second term. you can do anything you can see a difference is same 53 minus 56 we get minus 3 or 50 minus 53 you will get minus 3 or 47 minus 50 we get minus 3 difference will be equal so here we can write 53 minus 50 uh, 6 t2 minus t1 and when you subtract we get here minus 3 because 56 is greater and in front of 53 56 here is minus so we have to write on minus so difference is equal to minus 3 now what we have to find out 120 term n is equal to what 120 so we know that we can write here we know that what is the formula of tn a plus n minus 1 d so here a plus n minus 1 d and what is the value of n what we have to find out 120 term t 120 so value of n is equal to 120 we have to write here 120 a plus in the place of n we have to write on 120 minus 1 and here we have to write on d similarly what is the value of a a means here 56 so we have to write here 56 plus when you subtract this 120 minus 1 we get here 119 into d the value of d is equal to what is there minus 3 now just we have to calculate and we have to write on answer 56 plus minus minus and we have to multiply this 119 into 3 we get here 357 and when you subtract we get here minus 301 Hope you understand this question number 1a, 1b and 1c. If you understand, please hit the like button and if you are new on my channel, please consider subscribe and do not forget to hit the bell button to get notification of upcoming videos. Thanks for watching till last in second uh, part, I will solve question number 2. Thank you.